Hello everyone, this is Smox from Celebrant Quest. Welcome back to my blind playthrough of Above Snakes. And we have our beautiful little hut here, which I would like to expand. Um, and in the last episode, we, we planted down the lumberjack cave over here and also um, the glade here where we're supposed to be hunting some animals but um, I haven't yet got a bow and arrow so I don't think that's going to be <laughs> happening anytime soon so um, I wanted to see how I could get a bow and arrow but I want to ke keep on um, expanding our base too because it's quite small and um, really unimpressive so uh, let's pop down a few more foundations and see if we can expand. I do love the art style of the game, I've got to say. It's very pretty. I don't know how you are all finding it, but I think it's absolutely beautiful. The lumber that we need. I'm searching the trees before I cut them down because sometimes they give... Um, sometimes they give feathers which can be used for other things in the game so I just want to make sure that I've you know, I'm collecting things efficiently I guess is the way to put it um, okay so let's go to our workbench let's change our view a little bit let's go to our workbench and we'll build some more foundations although actually what have I got here I've got um, let's just build one more foundation and then we can make it a three by three yeah let's do that so log foundation beautiful I also want to make the roof line a little nicer as well let's pop that down yeah now to get rid of the walls I have to use my hammer so I'm going to I tear it down I want to move it oh no what did I tear down then oh no <laughs> let's go inside and just see what I tear down I think that might have been the table instead oh darn we did the table well you know what that's that's fine that's how it goes um, alright, so I want to move wall. Aha! Yes. Okay, great. That's good, that's good. To move this one. Move that there. Gosh, this is a very slow process. <laughs> oh no, where did I move it to? That's not where I wanted it. There we go. Um, this should be another one. What have I done? No, I don't want that. I want this wall right here. There we are. Go. Why does it look like that? Is that because I've... Oh, I've got the roof on top. Okay. So if I do the roof, I think I want to tear down the roof because it's quite ugly. Let's tear that down. Let's tear down these all these roofs. We'll get these resources back. No, I want to put that wall back, please. Can I cancel? Nope. <laughs> okay, looks like I accidentally took out a, a wall piece, so... We'll have to fix that, that's okay. Alright, so I need one, two, three, four, five pieces of wall. Get out of building mode. Alright. So I need two. Beautiful. It's pretty easy actually. The crafting is not bad in this game. You there. Um, we only have two windows, so I'm going to put a window at the back here. 
Um, or do I have to craft that differently? Hmm. Um, I don't know. You know what, we'll just go with the walls for now. That looks so much nicer. Alright, and now we'll build some roof pieces. So we have the flat roof. We also have the log roof that's it's sloped. Um, so how would I do that? I guess I... Let's make a couple of these. Let's go with four of those for now and just see how it looks on the building. Okay, so... Okay. So does that mean that we have to... We do this. We can have them along here, but then what's going to go in those middle pieces? Do I have to do the flat roof? I might do. Looks like that's probably what I have to do. Yeah, because if I put another wall up here and another sloped roof, then I'm going to have a problem when they attach there. Um, okay, well, let's just, let's just make a few more pieces. Wait, how many do I need? Uh, two, no, two more for the sloped. And then I guess we'll need three of these just flat ones. Let's just see how these go. Hopefully it'll look a little bit nicer than it did before. Let's come around the back side of the hut here. There we go. And where are my flat pieces? There we are. Um, hmm. Okay, that looks really odd, doesn't it? Oh dear. Is this just, is this destined to just look terrible? It might do. Oh my god, that looks so bad. <laughs> that looks so bad. Alrighty, look at that beautiful hut. Mm-hmm, gorgeous. With next to no windows. That's, uh, I'd say it's pretty successful. <laughs> All right, let's go to um, take a look at the workbench and see what we need for our... Oh, that's right, the fletching table. That's right. Okay, here's our fletching table. What do we need? Ah, huh. oh, look. Okay, so handcrafted, we can do... Oh, look. Upgraded axe, upgraded pickaxe. We just need some flint for both of those. Let's try to get some flint. Oh, you can make flint. Oh, well, it's very easy. Let's do that. What else do we need? Enhanced axe. We need a hard antler, which we don't have, but we have on our pickaxe. So I don't know if we can destroy that, maybe. Bone axe requires three bones. I might have... I think I've got two bones in the storage box inside the house. Okay. Alright, let's make our axe and our pickaxe. Because I feel like that's going to improve things drastically. So, how do I now assign them to my hotbar? Um... So instead of my primitive axe, I want my normal axe on a side. Okay, let's see if that does. Oh, great. And then the pickaxe I want on number two. Does this work? Oh, it does. Beautiful. Um, yeah, all right. Well, before it gets really dark, let's just get out our axe and let's just see if that makes a difference in terms of how many... Um, branches, um, planks, and that sort of thing we get, the lumber. Okay, it only took four hits to take down that tree, so... Oh, we also got plant fibers. But is that because I accidentally hit a bush? I don't know, we'll have to find out. Let's see if this tree gives us plant fibers, because there's no... I mean, I know there's one sitting on the ground there. I won't count that one. Just pick that up now, so I'm not confused. <laughs> um, no, all right. So it might be that let's get our pickaxe. It might be that 
um, it just requires less hits to break the resources. Yeah, it looks like that's what's happened. I think, yeah, I think it took three before for those ones. Some berries. And we have a world piece available. Alright, let's go back home. Really, really need some water. Let's see if we can cook any more food. Because we need some water. We need the hunger stat to be um, taken care of as well. Okay, so we've got carrots. What happens if we just put carrots? A lot of hunger. Mm hmm. Okay. Uh, and then what happens if we cook all the mushrooms? That's sanity as well. Let's cook that. That looks good. Let's put in carrot. What happens if we add some honey? Okay, it takes away the water stat. What if we add some vanilla? What's that? Oh, health. Well, might as well cook up some of these. Um, what if we add a berry? Yeah, cool. What if we add some mint? Well, that's pretty nice. Let's add some of that. There are all our carrots used. That's not bad. Just those two there. Add a berry. Cool. Gives us a bit of everything. Um, you know what? Instead of the berry, why don't we add some water? There we go. Well, I'd say that was pretty successful cooking. Um, okay, let's eat some of this stuff now. So... Consumables. Okay, so we've got our thirst fatigue health. Um, or hunger stat as well. Thirst. So hunger for hunger sanity. Hunger and sanity. Hunger and health. Oh, Brand's what's this? Brown's miracle tonic. Brown family swears that this tonic cures all kinds of wounds. Oh, okay. Must have got that from Sam or um, what's his brother? Greg, was it? I think it was Greg. Um, all right, let's just eat that one and see what happens. Okay, that gave us a lot of thirst. That's hunger 10. Hunger 30, that's a good one. Let's eat that. There we go. Um, right. Very good. Okay, what else can we cook at the, the fletching table? So we don't have any ingots yet, so we can't smelt any metal. How do I make the bowstring? Hmm. Sawmill is locked. A gunsmith. Okay, that. Oh, a furnace, right? Tannery. Let's make some rope and just see if, um, I don't know if that becomes, oh, I have to make it at the tanner. Okay. Do a fishing rod. Let's make a fishing rod because we might be able to go to the lake and fish. That's pretty cool. All right. Let's see. Um. So it turned out we actually did have some rope from the tannery. Let's make some fabric in case we need it as well. A decorative plant, you know what? Let's just make one. <laughs> no? No, I can't make that one. Okay. Oh, because it has to be at their workstation. Oh. Got you. Okay, let's make it. It's kind of cute. Let's place that down. Oh, that's very nice. Where can I place it? Indoor plant it is. Let's put it at the foot of our bed. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Alright, we do also have some world pieces available. We... Okay, we can't... We can't research anything at the 
photography table, but that's okay. Um, you know what? Let's just head to the glade and let's just see what's there. If we do happen to run into any trees that have um, beehives, we'll collect those because the beeswax and the honey is um, fairly useful from what I can see. Well, especially the beeswax. Here we are. Let's see what we're doing. Okay. It's a bit better. So. Okay. Oop. Here's one with these. Oh, and there's some more mushrooms. I'll pick those up too. I can see that this is a game where you could just literally spend the whole time just gathering resources, honestly, and just making things. That's pretty cool. Hit the tree, please, Ayana. I think her name's Ayana. Hey. <laughs> okay. Alright, so we're approaching the glade. The, um, the lumberjack did say, oh, we need, oh, okay. What was it that fought this poor animal? Maybe this is how we get the skull of a big animal. Dead animal skull. <gasps> oh dear, what is that? Snakes. <laughs> Snakes. Oh my gosh. Attack, attack. Oh, that's lucky. Hello? Uh, are you, like, stuck there? Oh, okay. <laughs> How do I... Oh, is that bugged? Skin and gut. Okay, well that's not bugged. I got meat. It's just so strange. Alright, hang on. Skin and gut. Oh, okay, that was just a, a glitch. To trying to fight a dead um <laughs> a dead snake. Oh what's this? He'd get grave inscription. Okay, Dave. God, I've been poisoned. <laughs> Here in the forest, dark and deep, I offer you eternal sleep. Oh no. Is, oh shite. Is this where we use uh, let's see, we've got an antidote in here. It says health and sanity. I don't know if I want to use it just yet, though. Um, hmm. Let's deliver the skull to Stark, and then when our health gets low, then I'll possibly... Oh, oh no, what is this? Did we see this before? I don't think so. He lies blue. He was a good boy. Oh, that's sad. Okie doke. That's probably his... Um... Probably his dog. But he's still got um, bass. Here we are. Hello, Mr. Stark. Oh, what's in hmm. your case? Did you happen to bring me that skull? You found one. Great job. Excuse me for a second. I'm going to make something special out of this. Please have this axe as a small thank you. Oh, seriously? I just made an axe. <laughs> this will take some time. Alright, so... Oh, it didn't take that long, but it's here. <laughs> this is my hunting gear you're looking at. You already may have guessed it, but I am a passionate hunter. You seem to be interested in hunting. Well, I mean, I'm just doing it because I have to. Tell him you don't like hunting. Tell him you'd love to learn to hunt. Well, I think for the purposes of the game, I'd love to learn. Unfortunately, I don't have any hunting gear. Well, this gear here is mine, and I need it myself. So you'll have to get your own bow. But I would love to help. Hunter's code. Right. Somebody with your crafting skills should certainly be able to make a bow. I have some tendon di uh, drying on my porch that could be used as a bowstring. Oh, that's how we get the bowstring. Okay, so we need to do some deer hunting. We need to craft a short bow at the fletching table and then hunt a deer in the pine forest. Okay, we can do that. Rare key. 
All right, where's the bowstring? There it is. Oh, wonderful. Hello, Bass. How are you? Oh, I'm going to rub his belly. <laughs> Alrighty. What a cutie. Every time you see a dog, you got to rub their belly. I mean, there's no other option, is there? Okay, we'll chop down this tree as well, may as well. And then we'll head home. We're going to um, make our bow. Open the chest. Why not? Oh, I've got some rocks. <laughs> Always handy. Let's head home. We will open uh, our fletching table, make a bow. Um, yeah. And see if we can go and hunt them deer. Alright, fletching table. Short bow. Awesome. Let's make that. Okay. We better make some arrows as well. How many arrows? Oh, I'm going to need flint. Okay. Um, let's take out some of this rock and then we'll make some flint with the work table. I think if we make about, I don't know, is 20 arrows too much? Is that overkill? <laughs> I feel like I'm um I feel like I'm gonna miss a few so I wanna have it extra on hand. <laughs> Alright, let's go and make our flint. Nope, maybe the flint was at the fletching table. Make uh well I guess okay, well six we'll have to do for now. And I guess we'll just make as many arrows as we can. So what's that nine? Oh no, it's a hundred. <laughs> it's a hundred and thirty-five. Okay, let's just make thirty for now. Actually, let's make forty-five. I mean, flint we can gather easily. All right. Oh my gosh, this is cool. Okay, let's wait for the next day, and. We can then go out and um, and use our bow. Okay, we don't have any water. Oh, let's make. Uh, let's see if we can cook our meat, because I'm going to assume that that's going to go bad if we don't. That's a new recipe. That'll be good. Let's cook that. Oh, a meat skewer. Nice. No, I don't want to add honey to my recipes. Please make it off. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it doesn't like to not use honey, apparently. Um, use the mint. Beautiful. Okay. So, I do need to go and get some water, but consumables do we have? I know I do this every time. What consumables do we have that will give me water back? <laughs> oh, that one. That's a good one. Beautiful. And then our meat skewer does 65 hunger. That's pretty good. I don't know what level that, you know, our hunger is or anything. By looking at it, it doesn't have any numbers. Let's sleep. I love how I just never close the door to my heart. <sighs> Alrighty, it is the next morning. Okay, I wonder what they gave me that antidote for because that, it mustn't have been for that one. Or was it? I don't know, because it wasn't very, um, like the, the poison that I got from that grave wasn't, um, really hurt me very much. Uh, let's just have some of this this. I'm gonna go to the well actually before we set off to, not the well, uh, the lake. I'm gonna go to the lake, get a few more bottles of water. 
and um, while the fire is on, we'll take this up and make make nice drinkable water. I guess the right way to say that. Oh, you know what? Actually, while we're here, where's my pickaxe? Aha! <laughs> Let's see what's um see what's in here. Can we get this? Oh, the tool is too weak. Okay, so we still can't get whatever is in there. Interesting. I think that must be the tin, maybe. Um, Alright, let's make some water. Okay, let's go and hunt some deer. Oh, before we do... Let's make sure we actually have our equipment on our hotbar. Now, short bow, what do I want to use? Maybe, let's put that maybe into three. I don't really see why I need my, um, why I need my hammer there. Um, now, do the arrows just, what did I do then? Do the arrows just automatically, short bow equipped two gear level, Okay, rage damage 12. Alright, I don't know what I did just then, but why have I got the axe symbol just here? Ah, well, I don't know why it's there, because I want to use my bow and arrow in the glade. Let's go. Oh, the deer. Wait, what's that? Is that it? Just a... <laughs> it might just be the tree. <laughs> yeah, that's just the tree. Okay, but I can see a little bunny. Uh, no? I really would like to use my arrow, friend. Oh, okay. Ah, there we go. So right click. Gotcha. Oh, that should be good. I wonder how many kits the... Oh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, it just fired itself. <laughs> That's good to know. Alright. So where are the deer? Have I scared them off? Maybe I need to add another tile of, um, of the forest. Let's see. Let's add an an another pine forest. Add it next to the, the hunter's camp because, I mean, he's probably going to use it. Oh, there's a deer. Let's go. Oh, it's one of those spitting ones. How far does this shoot? No, right behind a tree. Gosh, it's taking cover. Oh. Oh, so I don't need to hold. I just need to press. Great, look at that. That was awesome. All right. Let's risk risk uh, scaring off the deer by trying to get that. Oh, here we go. Nope. Nope. Uh, yep. Oh my gosh, it did it. <laughs> Just firing off. Firing off um, arrows everywhere. Oh, we get lots from the deer. Oh, hard antlers. Great. Okay, let's go back to Stark. We're right here. Hello, Mr. Stark. I did it. I'm very proud of myself. I, he'll be hmm. like, oh my god, you actually did it. Ta-da! took some time, but I've created something very special out of that animal skull. But see here, it's private. I don't want just anyone to know what it is. Oh dear, what is it? I don't care. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll. Uh, maybe later I'll show you if I know I can trust you. Okay, that doesn't sound good. <laughs> you know, maybe you could earn that trust. I've put uh, what I've made into this parcel. It needs to be delivered to Corpse Creek. Oh, okay. Um, ask why doesn't trust you. Decline to help. Offer. Oh well, I'll just deliver it. Sure. Um, I need to... Oh, so it needs to go to the trading post. Okay. Oh, would you do that? That would
would be fantastic, but please don't look too closely at the label. Are we on the same page? Uh, I think so. Okay, so I need to craft leather armor and equip leather armor. Okay. Alright, so we need to go to the trading post. Well, God, we've got so much done this episode. Um... All right, so what was that that just came up there? I, I, I probably need to do it at the cartography table. What's this one? Animal watering hole. Oh, fantastic. All right, let's go home. Oh, this is awesome. All right, you know what, guys? I'm going to leave it here. Thank you so much for watching. Next time, we're going to craft up some leather armor if we can. We're going to research the next uh, watering hole um, world piece. Place that down and, um, and we'll see what else occurs. I'm Smox from Celebrant, uh, Celebrant Quest. And um, thank you so much for joining me. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.